Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It is 2022 and that's really exciting. It's been a while since I've made a video. I think we're starting off with a bang, okay? Recently, I have been watching a lot of YouTube because I ran out of things to watch on Netflix and Hulu and stuff. I am wow. bored with it, okay? So I have been watching YouTube. I recently have been kind of binge watching Jenna Marbles videos. And so one of the videos I watched this week was her like cutting her hair and it looked so easy and it turned out really good. So obviously my hair is a lot shorter than hers in her video, but I went and I watched the video that she referenced and uh, another one, so I'll link them both in the description box for you guys, just in case you wanna follow them. It just looks so easy and I haven't had a haircut in like thousands of years. So I just kind of wanted to try something new for 2022. So this is what my hair looks like right now and I am just gonna make it look like not this. Oh, you know what? Actually, I should probably have a mirror. I gotta go get a mirror because I forgot to do that before I started this. So I'm gonna go do that and then I'll be back and then we can give myself a haircut. So I like press record way too fast. I just like ran to the garage and ran back. So I have my mirror now, I'm ready. My hair is pretty straight generally, but the girl in the tutorial that I'm following because Jenna Marbles followed it, she straightened her hair or she suggests to so that your cut is like perfect. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna cut my hair real quick. Or I mean, I'm gonna straighten it really quick. So I'm just gonna kind of breeze through it. Like I haven't straightened my hair in a long time. I also forgot to grab my hairbrush, which is something that I'm gonna need. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> Look at how fast that went. Okay. My hair is like super clean, which I know a lot of people like cut their hair before they wash it, but I could not appear in this video today with my hair in the condition that it was yesterday, okay? It was just beyond. I think that looks pretty straight. I'm gonna like get started. <laughs> I'm a little nervous because I've never cut my own hair before and also I'm gonna be using kitchen scissors because I swear to god I have hair cutting scissors but they like I lost them like I have like thinning shears and all that but I just can't find them. So this is what my hair looks like now. I feel like I should give you like an adequate kind of before shot. So here it is like to the front. And then this is what it looks like to the back. So this is what the back of my hair looks like currently. And I'm gonna cut it now. So this is really exciting for me, obviously. Yeah, so the first thing that they do after straightening their hair is brush it all to the front like this. And the tutorial that I watched said that if you put it, rather than putting your hair, like if you put your hair further to the front, you get longer layers in the front. But if you put it a little further back, you get more layers in the back. So I'm not gonna put it right at the beginning of my head because I do kind of want to have it be a little bit layered. <laughs> I'm a little bit like terrified, but it's gonna be fine, okay? So this is what we're working with. Literally about to cut my hair with kitchen scissors. I just, I don't wanna ruin my hair because I don't go anywhere. So it's not like it matters that much, but I would like my hair to look okay, you know? And actually, it looks pretty good. Like my hair, I feel like my hair is really healthy. Like I feel like my, en okay, my ends look worse on camera than they do in real life. Like they feel good, they're not like fried. This is what we're working with and I feel like it looks pretty good. Like I'm only doing this because I saw Jenna Marbles do it and I was like thoroughly inspired. But yeah, so the last time I got it cut, I got like face framey bits done and um, I forgot what I was gonna say. So this isn't where I'm cutting it, but the girl in the tutorial says that you should put the hair tie, the first hair tie like where your chin is. I don't know how much of this I'm gonna cut off. I'll probably cut at least to here. That's a lot. Maybe like to here, just to get like all the kind of split bits off. Well, actually maybe I'll go a little further up. Because I don't mind having really short hair. I kind of like the way it looks, but I am kind of trying to grow it out. I'm just, bored with it, I think. I'm just looking for things to do with my hair. 
I'm gonna cut below the hair tie, definitely. And then we're just gonna see what that looks like and then get into it. Yeah, like, yeah, look, look at, there's like, there's I don't, I don't. My hair is a lot shorter than Jenna's hair and then the girl in the original video. So I'm literally kind of going blind on this. I have no idea what this is about to look like. Wish me luck. I'm gonna cut it right now. Okay, that's like a lot of hair. You can just tell I'm stalling. Okay, so I have my kitchen scissors because I don't apparently have hair cutting scissors. And um, okay, here we go. Oh geez, here we go. Jesus, take the wheel. I did it. Where, where am I? That's how much I took off. It looks like a measly amount of hair, and it kind of is, but I don't want to ruin my hair, okay? I love my hair. Okay, I'm like kind of honestly like a little bit nervous to see what this looks like. Like there's definitely some choppy little bits in here. I love that you absolutely cannot see what I'm doing. I'm just trying not to make like a gigantic mess everywhere. Okay, so that, like, it looks pretty good and healthy. There's a chance that I will go ahead and just straight up cut like a lot more off. Cause I do actually really like the way I look with short hair. I'm just nervous to give myself short hair. You know what I'm saying? Really fun. Can you see what I'm doing? I'm cutting my hair. Okay, so I'm gonna take my hair tie out now. I'm gonna take a look at it and just sort of see what we're working with, all right? I think it looks pretty good from here. Ooh, that is shorter, definitely. I feel like that's not bad. It looks nice. There definitely are layers in the front. Layers in the front. I don't know if you can really see them. Actually, yeah, you can. See? That's kind of nice. Okay, not bad. Because I like the face for any bits. I just don't like them to be too long or too short because if they're too short, like I went to the hairstylist and I like had her cut like bangs, I guess. What I really meant to say was like long face framey bits because she cut them kind of short. And then like after that, they were just really short and they were always in my way. So I prefer them to be like longer like this because then I can put them like in a ponytail when I go to bed. So the results aren't like as drastic as Jenna's results or the girl in the video, but I feel like they, I feel like it looks pretty good. I'm kind of curious to do more. <laughs> I just don't want to like take it too far because I don't want to take too much more length. Is that right? Yeah, I don't really want to take too much more length off, but I do really like the way that this bit turned out because I was watching a movie, okay? This is just me ranting now. I was watching a movie a while ago with Jennifer Aniston in it and she had like long, really, really pretty layers. And I was like, that's what I want my hair to look like. So now I'm gonna grow my hair out so that it can look like Jennifer Aniston's hair because I like, I was like, oh my God. That's what I want my hair to look like. I don't remember what movie it was, but I remember just loving the way that her hair looked. I feel like I want to take a little more off. Is that horrible? No, I'm going to do it. Okay, I'm going to put it a little further forward this time. I don't know what that's going to do. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just doing things now. So now I'm putting another one in at my chin. Another one like just below that, just because <laughs> like I could probably just cut it but I don't really want to like just willy nilly do whatever, you know? That's so weird that like I put it all, I cut it straight and then it turns up like this. It's a point, it's like a little paintbrush. Um, I'm not gonna cut that much off. I don't wanna take that much off. That's like, that's like a little extreme. I'm just gonna cut this like little tip off here. So here we go, I'm cutting it again. Currently I don't like, <laughs> I don't really have any concept of where all my hair is right now. Like I know the back is like at the front and like the front is right here, but it's like still weird to me. Like where's the rest of it? What am I cutting right now? Is that weird? Like is that weird to anybody else? I think I'm the only one. These scissors are a little sticky. sticky. It's making it hard to do it accurately. So now that we have like a little eyeshadow brush worth of hair, I'm gonna take it out and just see what that looks like. It actually does look healthier. Like, I felt like my hair was already really healthy, but I, I just, now that I've cut it a little bit, it actually looks healthier. Can you see the hair coming down here? That's the most fun part. Okay, so that's the cut. I think I'm gonna not cut it anymore, but I don't know, we'll see. I feel like that looks really good, actually. <laughs> There's definitely layers in the front. I think that looks so good, dude. It looks so healthy. Like, I've been trying to take better care of my hair because 
sometimes I just don't touch it for ever like when i was like 15 i dyed it blue uh well i bleached it first at home i did all this by myself and then i dyed it blue after i bleached it like two weeks after i bleached it no tone or nothing and it was blue um permanently basically i used a semi-permanent dye and then it just stuck to the blonde hair that i had and um literally didn't leave until i got it chopped off well, I went into the stylist and I got it this color. I had her dye it this color and kept all the length. And then I went back and chopped it like three months later. So this is all virgin hair, which I'm really proud of that. <laughs> I think that this looks really good. I like, I actually really like these layers in the front. I think they look really, really nice. They're not like too short so that they're in my face and bothering me all the time. And then here's what the back looks. Oh my God, you guys. Wait, that looks so good. So this is what it looks like after the cut. I feel like that looks so good. Like I can, I can definitely see the layers. They're not crazy, which is good because if they were, I don't know what I would do with myself. I think I feel like it looks really good. It looks a lot healthier, which is crazy because it already looked and felt really healthy. But I really, I'm, I'm impressed. That was really easy and. I think it looks really good. <laughs> so yeah, that is me giving myself a haircut. Wow, wow it, looks it looks so looks good. good. I don't know if you guys can tell the difference, but I can. It's honestly making me want to cut more, <laughs> but I don't want to, you know, go, I don't want to take it too far. I'm really happy with the way that this turned out. I really am. Like that looks good. I'm going to put it in a ponytail just to see what it looks like. Just like how I usually do. Cause I'm, I'm like so bored with my hair or I was, okay. But it looks so good and it looks so healthy. I don't know if you guys can tell the difference. Yeah, you can. You definitely can, right? But like that looks so healthy. Oh my gosh. I'm really happy with this. That's me giving myself a haircut. Um, I'm really impressed with how easy this was and how like well it turned out. I don't really think you can tell that I did this at home. I don't know, can you? Can you tell that I did this at home? Anyway. Thank you guys for watching this video. That's so funny. I did it in one take. This took me 25 minutes to cut my hair. This took me 25 minutes and 30 seconds almost to get where we are right now. I think that's really impressive because I just gave myself a full on haircut. I am actually considering cutting more off because I do quite like it when my hair is short, but we'll see. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I thought it was fun and I will link the other videos that I watched for research purposes. I'll put them in the description box below um, so that if you want to follow them too, you can. And um, yeah, this is what my hair looks like now. I'm very happy with it. I really think it looks good. Thank you for watching this video. I am hoping to pump out more videos, more content in 2022. I'm hoping to make myself stay with it a little bit more, but we'll see. Sometimes I struggle with that. So I will see you in the next video, which hopefully will be like next week, but I don't know. We'll see. Peace out. Bye. Embarrassing, not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. I'm lost in your ocean eyes, drowning in paradise. Fourth of July. With our friends tonight, sitting by fire Like got your hand on my thigh Heaven on you, heaven on you Forever or am I just going insane? Stuck in my brain like a little tape on a paper plane Pop the champagne, first class flight to another